Hello, it's me. I was wondering <laughs> if you could help me out again. I know yes. we never talk, but I'm in way over my head this time. If you could just please get me out of this, please get me out of this, please get me out of this. If you could just please get me out of this, I'll do anything you want. These are basically the same words a million junkies, whores, thieves, and residents of the gutter have muttered to their thoughts when they're deep in this shit and all hope is lost. None of them ever keep this promise when all is said and done. We are all thoughtless until our moment of need. Truth is like the earth covered in a virgin snow, unmolested, with unlimited paths to be carved out before you in every direction. Which direction you choose to venture is completely up to you. Along the way, you'll cross the path to others. Some of these paths will follow for better or worse. The key is to be able to realize when the path you choose leads to doom. To have the courage to venture back out to the wilderness and carve out a new path. This is easier said than done. It's far easier to continue in the direction you set off in than it is to change direction and trudge back uphill, especially once you've already heading down a steep and icy slope. It was from here that I chose to go on to follow that path I was following. It wasn't easy for me to change. It didn't just happen overnight. I spent the last year deep in introspection to the er introspection to the error of my ways. It's hard to first face the man in the mirror. Once you can look yourself in the eye and understand why you do the things you do, and hold on to the fact you're the only person to blame for all the events that landed you in the gutter, it's easy to pick yourself up and get on with your life. The first step onto a new path is accepting responsibility for the consequences of all your actions. It took me the better part of the beginning of my life to realize no one makes you choose to follow the path you do. It was going to be a long, hot climb. I tumbled deep into a dark canyon of despair. But I decided that if I could find a way down into this pit, I surely could climb back up and start a new path through the virgin snow. This is a great read, and for anyone who has been through, is facing now, or wants to avoid this path, maybe just, maybe, if enough get the message and adhere to a personal responsibility credo, the society that molests our psyche and makes us this such an appealing option will begin to change too. The virgin snow awaits.